Good morning, everyone. I am up here in the Hiawinas on Memorial Day. It's about 9.15 in the morning. I'm going off trail backpacking. Uh, the elevation I'm currently parked at is about 9,800 feet. Uh, Mirror Lake Highway is closed. Uh, got a snow closure. The road hasn't been plowed yet. It's closed about a mile ahead of me. So we're getting pretty up there in elevation. Going to two ponds, no trail to get there. Never been there, don't know what to expect. I actually have my winter boots on because I know there's gonna be snow, mud, and uh, river crossing, so. Yep, crossing Mirror Lake Highway. probably going to be the most challenging part of my hike. I need to find a place to cross this river safely. You know, it's uh, it's not very deep, but it is spring runoff. It's nothing I want to fall into. I just found two logs that I could easily cross, but they're covered in ice. Uh, and that should give you an idea of how cold it's still getting. I'm going to walk up uh, yeah, 20 or 30 more yards. It looks like there's some other logs. and try and find a place to get across this. And right there is where I crossed. It was about a foot and a half deep at the deepest, so I just had to get through it real quick so it didn't come in my boot. I was hoping to find an easier spot to cross, but, you know, oh well. That's why I brought my big boots instead of my trail runners. I don't think any water got into my boot. Um, if it has, I haven't felt it yet, so. I had to walk about a quarter mile up the river to find that spot, so now I'm going to walk down the river and then uh, up over the hill and uh, see if we can't find these ponds. Ooh. Well, this is a pretty, uh, pretty challenging hike here to these ponds. Uh, there's three of them. I've never been to them. I don't know if they're covered in snow. I don't know if they're still frozen. I don't know if they have fish. <laughs> uh, but that's how you find new areas. So uh, we're going to check it out one way or another. Well, I gambled and it paid off. Still quite a bit of snow, but there's open water. I'm just trying to see if there's uh, any fish activity here. Have no idea. I'm gonna watch this one for a few minutes and I'm gonna walk uh, to the other one. It should just be five or so minutes the other direction and uh, look at that one and probably find a place to set up camp. I'm really excited. Oh wow, so this is the other lake. Uh, there's one more uh, just uh, to my right that's uh, not near as big. There appears to be a lot more dry ground around here. Um, I'm gonna see if I can't find a spot to camp. Okay, I have had some coffee, had a little snack, got my fishing pole together, and uh, yeah, we're gonna see what happens. I've been watching the water, I still haven't seen any activity, but there's still not a lot of bugs out uh, for there to be a whole lot of surface activity. All right, here we go, first casts, new lake. This is so pretty, man. Memorial Day in the Hiawinas. Uh, I got a lake to myself, three lakes to myself. Haven't seen or heard anybody. Won't see or hear anybody. And uh, I know some of you who know the Winnas are gonna recognize that behind me. So uh, I'm sure you'll figure out where I am pretty quick. <laughs> well, back at camp. <laughs> I did fish the other pond for just a minute or two, not even very long. Uh, and I didn't get or see anything, but uh, you know, I'm, I'm still convinced there's fish out here. I just gotta find them. So anyway, I'm gonna set my, uh, I'm gonna set my fishing stuff down and just kind of walk around the area with my camera. There's a lot of birds, a lot of squirrels, and um, yeah, we'll see if I can't go get, catch a picture of one or catch one on camera. Who knows? They'll probably all go and hide once I start walking around with a camera, but. I'm still up here alone, you know, not complaining.
Good afternoon, everyone. Um, I want to say it's around 4.30. Uh, <laughs> I have had such a relaxing time up here. I haven't done a whole lot. Uh, I, I literally fished for maybe 20 minutes. I do plan on going back down to the water. I've just, I've just been comfortable, just kind of hanging out. I put my uh, zoom lens on and tried to find some birds or other wildlife. I didn't do so good. Uh, the ducks wouldn't let me get too close to them, neither would the birds. I just need a better lens, but um, gathered a little bit of the firewood, you know, on the ground and on some of the down trees around camp. Pretty nice not needing to process anything, but uh, yeah, really, really good time. I'm a little tired. I got up here around nine o'clock, so been a long day already, but we're pretty close to finding my way down to the water and uh, fished for a bit. Good times. All right, I am uh, rigged up, walking right down to the water. It's close to camp. Uh, I'm gonna do some fishing again. I'm gonna try this pond, and uh, there's two more ponds. I might try those too, but uh, we're gonna start here and give it a you know an honest effort and go from there. Here's a view from the other side of the lake. Uh, I've been fishing here for 20 or 30 minutes. Uh, no luck. But look at the view. <laughs> oh, so much fun. I fished the big pond by camp, the small pond by camp. Um, obviously I didn't see any activity or catch anything. I just made the 10 minute walk uh, to the other pond uh, near camp. We'll give that a go before calling it a night. Um, having a great time. Obviously, I wish I was catching fish, but that's just how it goes sometimes. I've never been to either of these three ponds, and uh, you know, now I've uh, had that experience and I know what's up here. So, we're gonna go give this other one a run for its money, and uh, we'll be back at camp soon sitting around a fire. That is so beautiful. That ought to have fish. My heck. It's amazing up here. Back at camp, uh, I'm in for the evening, kind of just sitting uh, on my chair behind a tree, uh, halfway underneath my tarp, doing a hammock uh, this time. Gonna cook dinner, nothing too crazy, uh, stovetop stuffing with some chicken creation that I'm gonna mix into it. It's a pretty decent meal. I do have a proper breakfast that I'm actually pretty excited about, but we'll uh, do that in the morning, so. We'll get some dinner going, I'll have a fire going probably after that, and uh, we'll start winding down. Awesome time. It may not look like much, but it's uh, it's pretty tasty. Try it sometime. <laughs> it's not that bad. Try it. You'd be surprised. Well, <laughs> I was just running a time lapse. I was going to do one of the sunset uh, while the fire got started. While that was going on, I was watching the water and the fish uh, came to life. In the last probably 30 minutes, I've seen at least 15, maybe 20 of them surface. They're jumping for bugs. Uh, so that's good to know. Uh, you know, I didn't think this could win or kill. It's big, it's pretty deep over on the other side. And um, so yeah, I just got them a little early. Here in the next week or two, they'll probably be prime time, but it is what it is. Uh, you know, I couldn't leave my fire unattended um, and go down to the water and feel good about that. There's a lot of dry wood around here. So anyway, so that's actually really good news. I'm excited about that. Uh, we'll keep this one in the toolbox for another day and uh, going to sit by a fire and have a good night, guys. morning. It's uh, about 10 after 7, just kind of getting up out of my hammock. Slept great. Had a, a really good night's sleep. I just got a fire started. Uh, that I'm, I'm going to feed that for just a minute. Um, I'm going to have just a small fire. I need just some coals. I need a small bed of coals so I can uh, cook breakfast. So while that happens over there on the fire, I'm going to start uh, probably getting packed up. Um, after I'm packed up, I'll cook my coffee, have breakfast, and uh, hike out of here.
All right, I'm gonna drag some of these coals out. Just to get away from some of the ash. Butter? Oh yeah. Yeah. That's some pretty thick pepper bacon. We'll pack those eggshells out. Oh yeah. All right, got my coffee right here. Got a little bun, a little piece of bread. We're gonna make a little egg sandwich and uh, about halfway packed up, so I'll finish packing up after I eat breakfast. I'll be on the uh, I'll be on the trail in 15 minutes. All right, it's about uh, 8:30, 8:45. I'm all packed up. Had a really good breakfast, coffee. I've uh, double checked that I haven't left anything behind. Uh, the fish are a little active again this morning, so uh, you know, again, I think that's really cool. Uh, it's just a little early in the season to be this high. The water's still really cold, but. Uh, you know, the fishing up here will pick up in the in the next coming weeks. But uh, I got to go home. So we're going to hit the trail. Thanks, everybody, for watching. We'll see you soon.